You know, as of 1970, I would say that was the year where it became a, uh, an obsession. When I was 12, and after the Gold Rush, Moondance, Sweet Baby James, Elton John's first record, Deja Vu, um, I mean, it was, it was the apex of the greatest singles still, Sure. and also the beginning of the greatest albums. It's called Listening Booth. The way I used to listen to music, aside from in my own room under headphones, was at John Wade Record Store, was the name of the store that was at Shaker Square in Cleveland, Ohio. Um, you could go in and in, you wouldn't have to buy a record without hearing it. You could go in the back of the store, there were five or six of these glass enclosed booths, a great turntable sitting there, and you could pick the records, which I used to, and check them out before buying them. I mean, I never would have imagined 20 years ago doing a record like this, because to me the whole attraction for me was my self-expression, right? right? But 20 years down the road, I'm sort of finding like, you know what? Some of my favorite singers aren't writers, and some of the best records I love are not singer-songwriter right. records, and there was really a cool way to sort of still be, um, still express something very personal through other people's music, and even if I'm only focusing on Right. being the singer. Uh, Wild World was the key into this album, perhaps, for both of us. It was the first song we thoroughly deconstructed, and I think it, it uh, in that we did it completely differently from Cat Stevens. <laughs> well, I remember that was sort of the, the first indication that this concept of 1970 was going to work. Because you called me and you'd finally, you said, hey, check this out. You would come up with a groove. So do you remember, like, the moment when you found a way into doing Wild World, it was sure. different? Sure, yeah, 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 absolutely. Uh, you know, part of our process is we were just never going to do a version like the original, so I guess the original is more like... Um, which we totally left out, right? We don't even sing that. Yeah, which is great. Yeah, we love all that. But, uh, you know, so my brain just has to throw that out. <laughs> And, um, and, you know, I can't explain exactly, but it's just sort of like, well, what if it kind of swung a little bit? It was, you know, so the, the, before I even did anything, I just did this, I think. It just went. And the, uh, literally the second I did that, I said, oh, that's it, you know. Right. And then you started singing, you know, I said, can you sing to that? And. Because I never want to leave you sad, girl. Don't be a bad girl. But if you want to leave, take good care. Hope you make a lot of nice friends out there. But just remember there's a lot of bad out Child. 